this is super late because stuff and you know <laughs> but uh season seven i hope isn't the final season is coming august 11th great thing is not coming on a school day because i don't know how that's gonna end anywho let's check out these episodes like i was supposed to a life less scordinary and the trollathon. The trollathon. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Poppy attempts to make life in Trollstopia more in exciting by adding an intense soundtrack and narration. What? Who wants that? And Synth and Smidge discover that training Minnie at Sonata for the big race is kind of harder than they thought. Wait, what? Hold up! This isn't the thing from season four, five, is it? I think season five. Hold up! When did Synth become a trainer? I know in season five, but what? Okay. Air apparent and under new management. Cloud Guy gets accepted in the Cloud College and sets out to find a suitable replacement to continue annoying Branch in his absence. Why does he want to do that? I don't know. I don't. And I never understood. I don't. I just don't. And. God. And feeling smothered by Demo's management, Sm Dial Val decides to find another manager that better suits her needs. Oh my god. Whoa there. No, dude. Demo and Val are like the best manager client relationship I've ever seen. In a ch in a children's show, like, dude, why? He's a good, he's a good person. I mean, I'm pretty sure she's gonna come to her senses at some point, or she's just gonna leave him <laughs> for someone else. Wow. And give me a break, once bitten, twice guy. I didn't know it was a reference to once bitten, twice shy. Wow. <laughs> Minuet's Sonata runs herself ragged, trying to perfect her violin plan for an audition. <laughs> oh god. This is exactly why I don't play violin. But I still like playing stringed instruments that you don't have to use a bow for. <laughs> and Guy prepares for his speech at a big glitter gala. And is bitten by a bat, turning him into a vampire. Oh, God. So, like, a glamorous vampire or something? Because, what? What is this speech going to be about anyway? <laughs> That's my question. Okay, the troublesome trio and hide and go hug. Is that a reference to Oh, no, never mind. I got it. <laughs> And the, this is just, wow, I never expected a trio like this. A group of trolls band together so that they can take over Trollstopia once and for all. What is this? Hold up. I want to know who that trio is, because I don't know if I'm going to be able to wait three months just to figure that out. And if we get a trailer in the middle of summer, then I will be super happy and I will probably just I'll scream my lungs out if we get a trailer in July. And if somebody actually announces it through an article, which I'm pretty sure they did, I'm gonna find it and I'm gonna scream even louder. <laughs> anyway, Synth, Dimo, and DJ are the only ones who are around to take on a pesky invasion of the raccoons! Dude! Where did raccoons come from? Volcano Rock City or something? R raccoons, dude! I, I mean, I know it's a reference to raccoons, you so know. I'm pretty sure it's like raccoons, but like rock trolls. Because <laughs> it's, it's in the name, raccoons. I, I don't know, I haven't seen a raccoon in person before. And Thunder Construction and the Techless Breakfast. What? I don't understand the names, but I get the plots perfectly. Tiny discovers he comes from a long line of expert blanket fort builders, so he sets out to build a structure worthy of his family's legacy. 
Oh no! If it's if it's focused on him, this is probably bound to be intriguing. Just don't you dare knock somebody's ears off with your freaking air horns! I swear I'm. Okay, on to the next one, and this one is Anbi promised to do all the cooking for an upcoming pancake breakfast. So why is it called the Techless Breakfast? I don't get it. Okay, we're getting near the end. The farmer in the house and Val serves more duty. I don't know who that is, but I can't wait to find out. When Biggie starts reading the saddest scrapbook in history, Bobby and Ollie have to prevent him from making that super sad ending. Oh crap. <laughs> what? I, I don't know, is that the Titanic? Titanic? Any reference to Titanic? I don't know. <laughs> And Val must fulfill her civic duty by dressing up as Moray, the Puffalo, the theme park's beloved mascot. What theme park? I don't. What? They're always opening something in that in that place. <laughs> and the final one, Gal Pal Getawaycation. That's a handful. And Troll Exchange Program. So the kind of like student exchange, but holy crap! Oh my god, dude, dude. Uh, okay. Val plans a vacation with Poppy and Holly, but little the, the cabin is literally just a freaking disaster. And King Trollex has been invited to Trollstopia and has invited a Trollstopian to come back to live. With the techno tribe, and Poppy gets to select who goes. I don't know. I hope it's not Branch. I don't know. It can't be Branch. He's one of the main characters, and we need him for, for, for the threequel. I don't know. It's either probably gonna be Synth or another troll. I don't know. I really hope it's not Synth either. He was a good character. And if we get to see Trollux and you know, the beat button in 2D. I'm gonna literally scream my lungs out. I will hurt everybody's ears. I will literally do just that. <laughs> God, I didn't know. I didn't know. I really hope this isn't the final season. Anyway, uh, don't mind the music. Bye.